it's Go Go Media Girl, and um, I'm at Fuse Academy with Lungiwe. 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 Mm. So, what do you do at Fuse Academy? I'm the office assistant. So, pretty much, my job is to make sure that the school is running properly. You know, I make sure that we have intakes, which means that we have a group every second month because the course is ten weeks. Okay. So I have to make sure that every ten months we have a new group that is going to be. Uh, doing their studies. And how long have you been doing this? Um, I've been here for almost a year now. Okay, cool. Mm. And how are you liking it? Yeah, it's cool, man. It's cool. It's fun. I mean, you, you get to interact with different people. I mean, we have about over 50 graduates a year. Okay, you know, cool. So I think now, because the school has been up for four years, four to five years, yeah. Okay. So it's like it has about almost 200 to 300 graduates. What do you think the best thing is about the school? Um, the best thing is, I mean, because right now it only deals with females. So, I mean, that alone, that woman empowerment type of thing, it's good, you know, so it's, it's, that's the best thing about it. You know when you come here, you've got to be dealing with people who understand women, you know. Okay. So, that alone, is, it's cool. And it's, I mean, it's Women's Month, you know, so it's hmm. the best. Okay, cool. How did that come about? Huh? Right. Um, the story behind the school being only, only taking females was um, DJ Zintli, who's the owner of the school. When she got into the industry, it was a bit tough, you know, and they were not, there are not a lot of female DJs. So having been trained by guys, you know, she found it that it was difficult because some guys actually want something, something, you know, for training you. So she decided, you know what, let me be, have an academy that is going to teach girls alone without them having to feel that pressure of saying guys saying, no, you girls can make it, this is our industry. So she felt, you know, the more she does it with only women, it's going to create a lot of, um, it's going to, how can I put it? It's going to, like, opportunity. opportunity to a lot of female DJs. How did you um, get to know about this um, Fuse Academy? Um, I saw, I went online, actually. Is, I mean, at some point in my life, I actually wanted to know and get into the into music industry. So as I was Googling, I came across Fuse Academy. You know, and luckily for me, there was an opening and they needed an office assistant. So I just decided, yeah, let me do it. How, um, as being an office assistant, let you learn about being a DJ? Mm, yeah, I've gotten to learn, because I mean, I need to know. I mean, pretty much when I got here, I didn't even know the CDJs, what the difference was, and how, you know, I, I didn't know pretty much anything about the industry, you know. So getting to work with the DJs, DJ and Fuse, I've learned how it works, how the industry works, how to manage yourself in terms of getting to be a better person in terms of this industry. Okay, cool. Well, that was, um... Lungile. Lungile. Okay. Yeah, let's go. Okay. Um, and Coco Media Girl.